As soon as you get home, the first thing you're going to do is cleanse your home, cleanse your space. Open some windows, light a charcoal tablet, sprinkle some resin on top of it. smoke, make sure you get every corner.
you're going to warm up some water. Once the water has reached a temperature that's comfortable enough for you, then you're gonna pour it over a palangana. your ritual bath mixture to the water followed by your colognes. Once everything is nice and mixed, grab that little white candle, grab your basin, and either head to the bathtub or to your yard, wherever you are performing the ritual. Present your lit white candle to the four corners. You're going to start with east, then move west, then north, and finish south. Since this is a love bath, you're going to perform this bath in an inward, upward motion from your toes towards your knees. Then you move up to your arms and you're going to go from fingertips to elbows, both arms. And then you move up to your chest and to your neck. Whatever is left of the bath, you can pour it onto the ground, clean your basin, snuff out your candles. And now you're ready to begin with your fixed candle ritual. Since you're performing this fixed candle ritual with the assistance of your ancestors, this is going to be performed on their altar. You're going to need three cups of water. One cup you're going to drink before prayer to open yourself up to prayer. Another cup you're going to drink to close prayer. And the third cup you're going to place on your nightstand by your bedside. And this cup is going to stay on your bedside 
for the entirety of the rituals and you can pour it out on the seventh night. and sprinkle some Florida water over it. Then you're going to wrap your head and sprinkle your ancestors' altar and then douse yourself with Florida water. about a minute just in silence to connect with the altar connect with the ritual connect with the process you're just going to sort of unload your thoughts and, and energy of the day your eyes and to say your prayers out loud. Day six of your ritual, this is where you're going to use your boosters. This is where you're going to use your krill powder and your conditioner. Condition oils must be worn on a clean body. And since you're doing love ritual, you're going to anoint yourself with the condition of your and the proper energy. You can also add a few drops to your fixed candle. Pearl powder can also be added on top of the picture, just a little bit over the face.
I'm home.